Hello, Connor here from Ludlow Thompson Estate Agents. Welcome back to another video. Here we are at Smithy Street. It's a fantastic two bedroom, uh, ex-local authority flat that's just come to market with us. It's split level. You have a really nice, good sized um, kitchen, a separate living room with balcony that opens up onto a lovely green space. And upstairs, you've got two double bedrooms and a bathroom. So where are we? We are bang in the middle of Stepney Green and Whitechapel. We are about a five minute walk from Stepney Green itself. Um, we're five to 10 minutes away from two different tube stations, Stepney Green Underground and Whitechapel Underground Station as well. You've got the allotment kitchen, which is a fantastic cafe, by the way, again, circa five to 10 minutes away, and Stepney City Farm also. Let's go and have a little look inside. Okay, so as we walk through the door, I'll just close it behind me. You immediately walk into this little hallway area. So we've got the living room here, stairs leading upstairs to our two bedrooms and a bathroom and the kitchen area. So we'll start in the kitchen seeing as we are here. This kitchen has been in quite a few years now, but it's in very, very good condition. If you wanted to replace it and maybe make it more modern, you could do, but it's perfectly usable and will certainly tie over a young couple or first time buyers, which I think are going to be the eventual buyer of this wonderful property for many, many years to come. It has been literally really, really well looked after. There's no marks, dents, scratches, or anything like that. You've got a little breakfast bar here, potentially to have your breakfast or a coffee on a Sunday morning while someone else is cooking. You've got a little bit of storage space in the cupboard here, just off the kitchen as well, as I mentioned. And then you've got your fridge and freezer, perfectly suited in the corner. So we'll walk around, again, places to hang your, your coats and jackets here. It, this is at home, it's an owner-occupied property. It doesn't need any work whatsoever. If you wanted to change the colour scheme or maybe a lick of paint, you could do, but it really doesn't need it. So beneath our feet, we have this really nice wooden floor. If you wanted to sand this and bring it back to its former glory, you could. Everything's been thought of really well, and for an ex-local authority property, this is quite rare. You've got lovely down lights here that sprinkle the whole room with natural light and, and kind of light over the living area but they've also placed a lovely hanging light there above the dining table so that is exactly where the dining table was supposed to be um, you've got a lovely tv in the corner we'll just head around to this corner of the room and there you've got a little coffee table and again you can see it is really really well presented there's potential here for a lovely l-shaped sofa to come across um, coffee table and then maybe you can put your flat screen TV above the fireplace there on the wall options galore We will just head out here through the curtains And leads you out onto your private balcony as you can just see so it's not the biggest in the world But more than enough space for maybe two chairs and a little table and it looks over a little communal green space directly outside the property now this is a really well maintained estate it's very clean, very tidy, as you can see with the lovely plants there on the ground floor. It's quiet, location's great. We'll head back inside. Head back out through the door to the living room and we will head upstairs. To your right hand side, you have a good size storage cupboard. See if I can open that and show you very quickly. Perfect for Hoover, ironing board, books, suitcases, whatever you want to do in here. And then into the bathroom. Again, it doesn't need any work whatsoever. You've got lovely tiles on the wall and the floor. You've got a bath here with a shower, a rainfall shower head as well. And a lovely glass shower screen there that folds across. Just whiz round and show you that one more time. You've got a radiator and a towel rail as well, which is handy. And then into bedroom number one. So both rooms are double bedrooms. Good size window there in the corner. More than enough space for a wardrobe, chest of drawers, bedside tables, double bed. You could definitely easily get a kind of a king or even a potential super king in here. I'll just stand around and show you this side as well. So you've got TV and then you've got a little wardrobe here with a very nice, looks like a pine or an oak door here as well. Again, with more storage. Excellent sized room. 
There's no camera trickery here. There's no wide angle lenses. What you get, what you see is what you get. You have a separate WC here. So perfect if it is a young couple, one person could be having a shower, the other person can use the toilet. There's no fighting for who gets in the bathroom first thing in the mornings. And then you have this slightly larger second room here, again, with fantastic built-in wardrobe that spans the whole width of this room. And a lovely, lovely double bed there. Um, again, with really nice wooden floors beneath our feet, good size window and a very nice hanging light there, chandelier. We'll just swing around. Even the color schemes in this place are great. You know, look at the light gray on the walls. You've got white ceilings. You've got lovely bed sheets here. The bed's beautiful. It doesn't need any work whatsoever. And then you have a lovely door here again that leads into further storage. So more suitcase storage space, more places to hang your coats, shoes, boots, whatever you want. And then of course you've got this storage space here again that runs across the whole width of the room so that concludes the internal tour you join me outside again right now so thanks very much for watching hopefully you enjoyed that very quick video tour like i said my name's connor from ludlow thompson all of the details are in our description below if you'd like to book in a viewing please pick up the phone we'd be more than happy to have a chat thanks very much for watching bye bye